Good afternoon. My intent was to be there in person to congratulate each of you. However, mission requires my presence in the Pentagon. Nonetheless, I did not want to miss the opportunity to extend my personal congratulations to each of you for your successful completion of this year's Best Warrior competition. You are to be commended on a job well done. Your competition started months ago as each of you distinguished yourself in your formation. While it is your market tenacity and determination that has sustained you in this uphill battle, it is your remarkable confidence and competence in land navigation, combatives, markmanship, warrior tasks and drills, and Army knowledge, however, that sets the 18 of you apart. You have represented over 15,000 MedCom soldiers flawlessly. Each of you exemplifies what it takes to be a soldier. Like Staff Sergeant Wayman, who demonstrated mental and physical toughness by maxing the APFT, or Staff Sergeant Chamberlain, who showed poise and calmness under extreme pressure in completing both the day and night land navigation in under an hour in the San Antonio heat. Every one of the events presented opportunities for individual growth as demonstrated by the young soldier who learned his lesson because he exceeded the time limit in land navigation after trying to find all the highest value targets first, resulting in numerous penalty points. Learning does not stop with the prep work done for each of the key tasks. Your participation in this competition demonstrates your commitment to the Army values and embodiment of the warrior ethos. You have shown beyond a doubt that you have what it takes to lead our Army. If this week's performance is any indication, our Army has a very bright future. Do not, however, let this be your pinnacle. I challenge you to strive to improve every day and seek continued personal and professional growth. I am so very proud of each and every one of you. Two of you have further distinguished yourselves among this elite field. In a few minutes, you will be honored as the MedCom Soldier and MedCom Non-Commissioned Officer of the Year. Stand proud, you represent the best of Army medicine. Remain focused, however, as your battle continues, this distinction does not only represent your past accomplishment, it is a call to continued perseverance and excellence as you represent MedCom in the Army-wide competition. I have no doubt you will be successful. I've seen the caliber of our soldiers in both the deployed and garrison environment. I know firsthand the talent, the drive and commitment that is in each of you. Know as you move forward in the competition that the AMED team stands behind you. I also want to publicly thank all those who planned, organized, and executed this event. Your efforts focus not just on preparing our soldiers for the competition, your efforts are critical in building the strategic bench upon which the Army will rely upon to support our future force. You can and should be extremely proud of your efforts. To each of you, thank you for all you have done and all that you continue to do for our Army. Serving to heal, honored to serve.